Welcome back to my channel. This is the fifth time I'm recording this because OBS keeps on uh, crashing. Hopefully it doesn't crash. I've got to keep focus from one screen to another to see if OBS is recording. Anyway, this video is about Pull ID. Uh, a lot of people have been having issues. I thought I'd do some digging and came up with this. I forked um, a copy of Pull ID and added some features, uh, namely face number you can uh, use face number or not use face number and if you use face number you can select the face in a group photo for example in this group uh, some uh, girl band i don't know who they are uh, one two three four five five faces uh, you can select any one of those faces uh, it's in i'm not sure exactly how the maths is calculated but it starts from zero so zero is one face and four would be the highest in this zero one two three four that's five um, you got a face select where you can select center face the face that's at the center largest face the largest face of the picture and normal which is uh, without center face or largest face Blur, if you got an uh, image with blurry faces uh, and some not blurred, some more blurred than others, then you can use this. It goes up to one. One select uh, the most focused. You might even uh, not select any, depending on how blurry the images are. But I usually select 0 0.01. That can only be used with normal. Same with the face number, that can only be used with normal. Uh, the mean, you can still use the means with uh, any of these uh, I know someone had um, center face in here but you can't use the means for the fusion uh, the, sorry not the means the fusion you can't use the fusion with center face if center face is in here um, okay I'm using GGUF T5 V1 1 XXL encoder Q8 0 GGUF for the clip one and clip L for the second model I'm using is pixel wave flux one dev q8 zero three um, I load inside face into CUDA I've got 16 gigabytes of VRAM it's not really a lot but it does the job uh, for that model I'm using steps of 8, CFG of 1, sampler name DPMPP underscore 2M and SGM uniform. So if we want to select the center face which is, uh, let's load this up, which is this person here. We just click on face select and select center face and uh, we've got a fixed seed. You prompt and this should generate an image with that person's face in it if they're all facing different directions it's easier to tell um, with just one face uh, it's obviously the quality is not that good I've got an upscale at the end but I've bypassed it for now I'm using four times clear reality version 1 so that's the cent uh, central person, which is that one. It doesn't match any of the others, so not too bad. Uh, say the largest face. How long did that take? 32 seconds? Maybe a bit more? Let's see. F first image obviously takes longer because you're loading the model, uh, loading the clips and assigning everything else and this one uh, looks like it's uh, the f not that one the first person with the curly hair yep curly hair uh, that's the largest and we use the s center face so to use other features you gotta swap that to normal Blur, it's not going to do anything on this image because it's not blurry, all, all of them with the same focus. And without using face number, if we do this, it'll select an image 
a face and generate an image. Let's see which one it is. That's the same as this one. So we can cancel that. We, I'm using the same seed. And I can enable face number and select face number zero, which possibly is this one. Yep, it's the same one. The so next one I'm going to use face number one, which is the second image, the second face. Second face should be someone different. I think it's the one on the right, I'm guessing. Um, yep, looks like it might be. Dark hair. Then again, they all got dark sort of hair. Let's see what happens. Oh, it's not dark hair. Which one is it then? It's not that one, it's not that one. It doesn't look like these two, so it must be that one. Yep. Uh, number three, which is number two. The prompt is similar to what it is. Uh, I've just changed it. Uh, it's using a six-year-old guy. Uh, just changed it, the writing to be Grafting Rayman instead of a Pull ID Flux. That's number three, which is number two. Number three, which is number four, is coming up now. That's the center one. This one, I think it's this, this girl here. You can tell by the hair. Is it that person? I don't know. The likeness, uh, maybe. Uh, let's go with number four, which is number five. Yeah, that that was uh, that one there. This one is this person here. You can tell by the angle of the head. So here I have four images of Zendaya. Preview, let's preview the image so we know what we want to create working on. I'm going to do the same and disable face number because, well, true or not, it's not going to make a difference. We're going to do center face, makes no difference, largest face, there's only one face per image, so it makes no difference. And uh, Q prompt. So we've got four faces. And we're going to generate an image. And that's uh, also using Pull ID Flux 0.9.1. This is uh, for Flux, these two. Um, you got SDXL version up there and SD 1.5 down below. That's Zendaya. Let's try randomize and upscale enabled uh, 1.5. It runs out of memory fast 
uh, where is the image? Oh, yeah. Let's run this again. I'm going to put the links in the description if you want to download my fork of pull ID and also the models I'll try and put it on there later and the uh, workflow will be in the same place as the fork I should have added that seed to this so it uses the same seed there might be some differences now it's the same image I'm gonna just waiting for it to upscale and uh, yeah um, there was another feature resize but that didn't actually do anything um, there may have been uh, other options that need to be set I didn't go too deep into that um, if you're having issues leave a message in the repo or in the description uh, in the comments and I'll look at it as soon as I can and um, yeah thanks for watching and um, see you next time just gonna wait for this to finish up and uh, load it up oh if you have more faces obviously the better the quality of the output there you go Not too bad.